The speaker that I chose was Adrian Kohler and Basil Jones from Handspring Puppet Company. Their thesis was on showing what it takes to breathe life into inanimate objects using puppeteers. They started off by showing a puppet that they made, but not by saying this is a puppet and then just going on from there. They actually brought the puppet to life and then broke down how they gave it life. The speaker engaged the audience using clips and pictures as well as bringing on an example. Joey, a full-sized horse, was made for the Broadway musical War Horse. He captured the audience by having three actors inside of him, which gave him a realistic persona. The Ted commandment that they really followed was Adrian and Basil showed us that they were real and didn't sell themselves or boast about their egos. The difference between Sir Ken Robinson and Adrian and Basil was Sir Ken Robinson was funny and made, an, made the audience laugh at his jokes while telling them about a very serious problem. Adrian and Basil presented their passion and dreams by using their knowledge and art backgrounds to create a living and breathing horse out of cane, sticks, and nylon mesh. I would have to say that they could have had per, um, performed their speech in a, in a better way, and they could have not used as much ums and errs and, and rehearsed a little bit more. Rehearsal is number one, and critiques are, that are, and critiques from trusted friends are important. The one thing that I can tell, I can tell from this TED speech that I can make apparent for everyone else is that speak from your heart, a place of passion, not from a teleprompter or notes on your screen. If you research your topic and understand your reasoning, then you'll get your point across.